you guys, Chris here from Top Puck, and today I wanted to show you how to win a face-off. First thing the key is on a face-off, have a plan. Know where you're going to go with that puck. Let your teammates know what's going to happen. If I'm going to come into the circle, I'm going to tie this guy up, my buddy's got to come in and get that puck, right? If I'm going to win that to my backhand, and he shoots off forward, and I win it to him, he ain't there, I'm in trouble. If I'm going to circle in and win that here, and he goes away, I'm in trouble. So I gotta say, hey, plus me to you, all right? And then I'm gonna have a plan. I'm gonna have a plan if I win the face-off, and I'm gonna have a plan if I lose the face-off. And there's a guy I've gotta keep here, so he doesn't get to that puck before me. All right, so let's take a look. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna win this puck, my backhand side here. The way that I do this, I start tight, my body's low, my hands are low on my stick, and the referee drops the puck. As soon as it leaves his hand, the puck is live. So as soon as it starts to drop, I move in forward and I sweep that puck back to my objective. Notice how close I am to this line, right? Look at his skates. You see, they're away. He's leaning in on that body. He's trying to get stick reach. There's no power coming off that stick. I'm low. I'm real close to that puck. A lot of power coming into that sweep. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to demonstrate the forehand win. Now you notice that my hand is turned over on my stick, so I can win it to the backhand if I need to. Now I still have that power on my forehand, but not nearly as much as if I'm pushing here. So what I've got to do, I've got my backhand like this, but I've got to use my body when I get in there. Use my body to move that puck forward, also to prevent him from getting to that puck first. Since we're on this dot, that's my net right there. I wouldn't want to win it to that net area that's where I don't want to score from. But for our intents and purposes, if I was down low on the other side and I wanted to win it there, that's how I'm going to demonstrate. Okay guys, now I'm going to show you uh, a tip to win it back between your legs. For this to work, your feet have got to be a little bit wide apart, you've got to be very close to the face-off circle, and again, the guy needs to know that it's going to come. The key is, I get my stick here first to prevent his stick from moving it, and then bring the puck back. So I'm going to watch the ref's hand, as soon as it leaves his hand, it's live and I can move. Okay, so we've seen a couple different ways to win the puck. You know, win it to the backhand over here, win it to the forehand over here, win it backhand through the legs. Now I'm going to show you a very, very difficult technique called a forward face off win. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to attempt to win the puck forward and get around him and get to the puck before the defenseman get a chance to get to it. Now, this is something that you're never going to want to try when you're in your own zone. Because if you're in your own zone and you win it forward, the defenseman gets that puck and shoots it right on net, you're in trouble. Now if you're in their zone, it's a great way to get a handle on the puck because they're also trying to win it back. So he may do all the work for me, especially if his teammates don't know what's going on. Okay, so in conclusion, when you're going to the face-off circle, have a plan. Have a plan what to do if you win the puck, have a plan what to do if you lose the puck. Also, let your teammates know what that plan is. Hey, it's coming to you. Hey, it's coming to you. Hey, I'm going to win it forward. Be ready to go jump. Let them know what that plan is so that your team is ready and prepared. 
doesn't matter if the other team knows what the plan is, all right? They still have to execute, and you're gonna execute better because you've watched our videos. Secondly, your hand position. Get your hands low on the stick. Low is power. You want your hands closer to the point of contact, which is right here. You're gonna win it to the backhand side. Over here, hand over gives you more power. You can reach a little bit more over to that backhand side. You're gonna win it to the forehand side. Put your palm on the backhand side of the stick. Move it over, move it over fast. Use your waist, use your body. Get a lot of pull on that. When you step into that face-off circle, you wanna be as close to the face-off circle as you can be. That way, you're generating the most amount of power you can possibly generate when you strike at that puck. And speed is key. The faster that you can move, the better off that it is. So you can catch this video and all of our other videos at toppuck.com.